Hi everybody, Cheryl here. I am gonna do a quick, well, I'm gonna try to make it quick, um, tutorial on, I'm going to just do something, just my natural nails here. And as I've mentioned um, in one of my other videos, I have damaged my nails, the reason that's why they look so bad, and I'm just letting them get a little bit more healthy before I put acrylics on. Um, I was moving some stuff around and literally ripped a few nails off. Uh, the thumbnails got damaged the worst. So um, so I'm doing my natural nails right now. And um, this is going to be a very simple, simple um, just nail polish with some gold leaf. Um, very simple. I'm going to put some stickers on. So first what you're going to want to do, and, um, I'm just like, I, I'm just going to use, um, this black clean color and golden. This is called golden nightmare. Okay. There you go. So it's uh, black with gold. Um, I'm using my gold leaf and I did a tutorial where I showed this is one where I cut with the Fimo blade so and then I'll probably put some of these um, stickers on it's going to be very basic so anyway what you're going to want to do is take um, your cuticle pusher and kind of clean the nails and push the cuticles back and once you prepped your nails and clean them off you want to wash your hands with warm soapy water I tend to like the antibacterial soap just because when you start pushing back your cuticles like that, you're opening yourself up for infection. So you just want to make sure that you get everything nice and sterile and clean underneath there. So anyway, so I don't go too long here. I'm going to just get started. And as you will find out as you watch more of my videos, as I post more of my videos, I am much better with acrylic than I am a nail polish. Um, I don't, and this is going to be a terrible angle for me. So we'll see how this goes. Um, you know, I don't edit my videos and, um, we will see, watch me. I'm going to just try to stay in the frame here. Watch me, um, do my fails and all. So here we go. This polish is so thick. Tell you what, I'm going to stop the video, finish painting my nails, and come back. Okay, I'm back. Um, so what I did was I put two coats of this um, clean color polish on and I did muck it up a little bit, and this is why I don't like nail polish. But um, <laughs> anyway, I'm going to be covering it up, so it's no big deal. Um, I just took one of these pens, and you fill it with um, with acetone. I have acetone here, and you put a little bit in there, and that's how you kind of clean up your ends, you know, if you get any on your skin. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to put some of this gold leaf. I'm, I don't know yet. I think I'm just going to do my thumb and my ring finger. I don't really know yet. Um, I'm just going to see what I feel like doing. So um, it's still a little tacky, and that's why I had to um, stop and, and paint the, my nails myself because without being under camera because this polish it, it was so thick it was almost like putting gel on so it was going to take so long so anyway I have some just uh, clear polish here I'm going to put it on super thin because again this is still it was such a thick polish I sat and I put it under the light but it just um it just I don't know I just don't, I want it to dry, um, and if I put too much stuff on there, it's just not going to dry. So that was just some clear polish, and again, I'm going to try to stay in the frame, and then I have my gold leaf here, and I'm just taking a fan brush, I'm just picking some, some pieces, random pieces up, and I'm going to lay them just randomly on 
the nail. And if it gets a little rough looking, that's okay because I'm going to actually um, be covering this with some gel um, top coat. Um, so it's, again, awkward angle for me, but I'm getting it. Um, the whole point of this is for it to be random anyway, so. And I don't know if I could pick up a little small piece to put right there. And that looks good. So, all right, I'm going to do um, my right hand, which we all know is not going to be as easy to do because um, I am right-handed so big thing is is I just want to stay in the frame and then plus I have a wet nail so I am very much gonna have to be careful here so alrighty and then just randomly lay this again you know with the polish it's fine um pick a few little pieces up that's a bigger piece but that's fine just it gold leaf is so thin that it'll you can fold it over and and stuff so if you get a bigger piece it'll it'll lay nicely it's not going to lay really heavy where I'm going to feel it even on the natural nail like I'm doing here so gold leaf is 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 good for that so you know once I cover it up and then I'm just going to take my finger even though it's still a little tacky from the clear polish and just make sure it's all down alrighty and that looks good so you can see that there I'm gonna go ahead I was gonna stick some of these white flowers on here but you know what I think I don't know well the white flowers yeah the white white flowers will show up with the gold leaf so I'm gonna put some on the thumb so let me do a thin 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 layer of clear on the thumb because again I want to make sure this dries um, and then put some gold leaf on and this is just something that's simple and you know and pretty to do on your natural nails um, and it really does not take a lot of time to do I sure hope I'm in the frame um, trying to get some smaller pieces, and then, um, now oh, wow, I picked a lot up there, and that's good. I don't want to do overkill on that, so I'm gonna take my finger and pat it down. Although I do want to put one little piece in that corner there. Whoops, and it went. And you, I don't know if you just, no, you didn't see that I had it out of frame. But that one piece curled up in a big old ball up right there. And I was able to push it down. And literally, it's even with my nails. So I can't even, this is so thin. It just lays nice. So there we go. I'm going to do this thumbnail. And very, 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 again, thin coat of clear clear polish make sure you get the whole nail and then grab your gold leaf and just start randomly dropping it on there um, and I apologize if I was not just in the frame there I'm just trying to get this done um, so uh, do do get it in there I need put a piece there mm. I want one little piece in that corner and then what I'm going to do is again with my finger just pat it down and make sure um, I have like, yeah, pushed that in. It looked like it wasn't on the nail, but I guess it was. 
So let me move this out of the way here. And then, um, so now I'm going to take my, I have a couple of these uh, nail stickers. They're just the floral, floral print. And, you know, I'm just going to, I don't, I think I'll put that one on. And it looks like I already mucked up my other thumb. Oh, for crying out. I'm not even in the frame here. Sorry. <laughs> so, alrighty. I don't know if you could see. I just put a little flower there. And then, um, I'll try to find one that was like that. Put it on the other thumb. Shoot. That was not good. I just rubbed it on my other nail. Ugh. And then just. And since these are my natural nails, I don't really want it to be too three dimensional or heavy because they are my natural nails. Otherwise, I probably put little rhinestones in there or something. But. I do not want to do that. So um, I'm not going to do anything else with the the ring finger. Um, I may, though, on my, my middle finger do. Um, and this is how I usually could tell what I like. I just take the, the sticker decal and I'll just lay it up on my nail and see. Oh, well, that's pretty. I like that. Or, I don't care for that. But... Um, that's kind of cool like that. I'll just take that one there and lay that. And it folded, shoot. So I'm gonna find a different one because I just wrecked that one. Um, and it stuck to my finger. Ah, story of my life. I am kind of awkward when it comes to doing my own nails. When it's, I mean, I, acrylic nails, I could do fine. Um, painting my nails, I think it's just because I've never had much luck getting um, the polish to dry right on me. And it just, and if I can get it to dry, you know, that's fine. But then it'll um, pop off and it'll come off in like one, one little layer. It looks like my fingernail. <laughs> So, um, I don't usually do nail polish, but my nails look like garbage, so I had to do something. Um, so, um, very simple design, um, just a gold leaf on the black. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my, my ASP top coat gel and put a layer of that on, and then I will be back and show you the finished product. Okay, I'm back just to show I um, used the ASP gel um, top coat, and I put some top coat on. Again, this is just a, a simple, simple design, simple for natural nails. You can see the shimmer. And then just put a little nail sticker on, on there, so. Anyway, that's my nails. Um, again, I'm <laughs> much better with acrylic than polish. So those of you who watched, I hope you enjoyed. Right now, I'm using my um, Unique Nail Creations Intensive Moisturizing Butter. I just um, am putting this on just because I just, you know, did my nails. And it's just cuticles need it <laughs> my nails need it my fingers need it my hands need it you know so I'm just putting some of this on just for moisture um I'll just rub it into my entire hands here and there you go I hope you guys enjoyed this simple natural what to do to your natural nail um, tutorial of just, you know, laying some gold leaf on nail polish. Um, 
So anyway, um, if you like it, like it. If you don't like it, then you don't like it. You're entitled to your opinion. Um, <laughs> but I hope you liked it. Anyway, comment down below if you have any questions or comments or whatever. So um, talk to you later. Hope you enjoyed. Bye.